Hey everybody, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to change your measurement interval for the altimeter feature on your Casio G-Shock GW9500 watch. What we're talking about here is when you're in your altimeter, how often does it take a reading? The other thing is how long will it leave you in the altimeter mode before it kicks you out if you don't do anything? That's what this uh, setting comes into play, what it does for you. Let's first start by going into our altimeter. We're going to press the bottom right button on the watch and that will take you into your altimeter mode. It'll start taking a reading. You can see what your current elevation is here in the middle. You've got your current time down here at the bottom. You've got some other things like that M is my battery level, and then I've got an alarm set. So those things really don't have anything to do with your altimeter. It's just some reference values for you. Up top, depending on how you have this set, normally people will have this graph that shows what's your elevation change been since you've been in your altimeter mode. This reading that it's taking can be adjusted. We're going to go ahead and we're going to look at our settings. While we're in the altimeter mode, we're going to press and hold the top left button, which is the adjust button. Hold it for a couple seconds. You will see your middle indicator blinking. We don't need to adjust this. This is going to be uh, your current altitude reading. Unless you're trying to set a reference altitude, you really wouldn't change this. What we're going to do is we're going to press the mode button one time and it will take you to a screen that says interval. By default from Casio, this will be set to two minutes. Two basically means it's going to, when you go into your altimeter mode, it's going to take a reading every second for the first three minutes that you're in it, and then every two minutes for the next 12 hours while you're in the altimeter mode. If you don't do anything, so if you go into altimeter mode and you just have the watch on your wrist, you don't touch any buttons, after 12 hours, it's going to kick you out of the altimeter mode and put you back in your timekeeping mode. If you want to change this, you can press the altimeter button. You have a different option in here that is five seconds. What this is going to do is when you go into the altimeter mode, it'll take a reading every second for the first three minutes, just like before, but then every five seconds for the next hour. You'd want to set it to this if you're going on a hike and you really want to get accurate information as you're hiking. You don't want any kind of delay. This is the value you would want. If you don't touch a button though, while you're in the altimeter mode, after one hour, it will kick you back to your timekeeping mode. You'll have to start all over with your reading. So if you're going on a hike that's an hour or less, I would set it to this value. If you're just using it as a reference or you're going on a trek, something that's a longer period of time, I would leave it at two minutes. Set it to whatever value you want. Once you're done, I'll just set it to this one just to give you a, a change. Once you're done, simply press the adjust button and you've successfully changed your measurement interval for your altimeter reading. 